Oftentimes, newcomers to tricking have the most problems learning butterfly twist and corkscrew. Here's something to think about. The common strategy when learning these difficult twist moves is to pick something like butterfly that brings you horizontal and simply add a twist. The problem with this approach is that if you simply add a twist, you're going to still be horizontal. This leaves you in a compromised posture for your landing as you won't be standing upright. In fact, a lot of people who've been successful taking this approach are simply capitalizing on an anatomical loophole. The hips bend forwards as much as 90 degrees, for some people even more. So a lot of times people can still be horizontal and just stick the legs out to get the landing. Ideally, you wanna to return to a standing posture. For this, I recommend following a base flip. Since the butterfly twist begins forward, the flip I recommend following is the Webster. Use a Webster first to ensure that you're kicking far enough into the takeoff so as to complete as much of the flip portion as possible. Meanwhile, once you complete the twist, you'll ideally have to land more upright. With a corkscrew, it's the same feature. A lot of people think about simply starting a slant gain or kicking over your shoulder and adding the twist. Once again, the problem is, if all you finish is the twist, you're gonna come out somewhere besides standing. What I recommend for cork is to follow a progression. Make sure you have a really solid backflip first that you can land upright so that you're used to getting your feet over backwards for a rotation. Change your takeoff to gainer. Think of uh, along the lines of a gainer switch. This allows you to start the takeoff and make sure you're really kicking pretty far backwards into that rotation. And finally, it's a good idea to have either a cart full or a standing full. Even a round off full will help you combine backwards rotation with the twist and still keep your landing. Once you have all the requisite techniques, a corkscrew is essentially the same thing as starting a gainer takeoff and combining with a back full in the air. Now for safety's sake, I recommend trying to learn both this and the butterfly twist at an equipped facility that has either crash pads or foam pits or both. In Hyper Trick School, you'll begin the long road to learning a corkscrew's progression by focusing on learning backwards rotation as well as the gainer takeoff, which will come in handy later on.